Hi, everyone. A woman says she was nearly run off the road and her life threatened all because she's Muslim. Now Murfreesboro police and the FBI are getting involved. New at 10, News Channel 5's John Quill Newland spoke to the woman and has her story. Yeah, that's right. Generations of Sarah Alzubi's family have lived in Murfreesboro, and so has she her entire life. But it was not until she converted to Islam that she saw another side of her community, one of intolerance and sometimes hate. And it came to a head yesterday afternoon. Now, since she still fears for her life, she's asked us to conceal her face. Love is blind, a saying that rings true for Murfreesboro native Sarah Alzubi, who married a Jordanian. And after the birth of their son in 2010, she converted to Islam. I read about it, learned about it. It was never something that was pushed on me. It was she admits the transition into society was tough. At one point, she chose not to wear her traditional hijab. Because I became so frustrated because it was a challenge when you would be out shopping and people would come up to you and say stuff to you or treat you differently at a restaurant. But over the years, she's become numb. That was until yesterday. Sarah was driving on Northwest Broad Street when she noticed a truck beside her. I had a truck that came up next to me on my right side who was looking into my vehicle and just kept looking. Things only escalated from there. He started spitting at my car. I was astonished. I mean, somebody just spitting at your car, they're like trying to make it inside your window spitting at you like they hate you. She says the truck began to swerve into her lane and nearly caused her to run off the road. What are you doing? What's wrong with you? What's going on? She managed to pull over in a median. The truck was right behind her. You could just tell by the way that he was jerking on a seatbelt. He was trying to get out of the car. He was yelling every profanity at me possible. The driver of that truck did get out and made his way to her car window. Both of his fists. And he was like, I will kill you. After a brief standoff between the two, the truck sped off, but not before Sarah captured this picture of the back of the vehicle. Murfreesboro police are investigating the incident as an aggravated assault motivated by an anti-Islamic bias. If you take the time out and learn, you'll realize that this is a religion of peace. Murfreesboro police have also contacted and notified the FBI since this appears to be a hate motivated crime. Now, if you have any information about that vehicle or the driver of that vehicle, you're asked to call police or Crime Stoppers. Information leading to arrest could earn you up to $1,000. Back to you guys. That is scary. Thank you, John Quill. Now, Islam is the second largest religion in the world behind Christianity with 1.3 billion followers worldwide.